Developing now a child tragedy, a Central Florida community mourning the loss of an 11 year old boy who died of a flesh eating bacteria. At first, doctors believed that a sprained ankle was just a minor injury, but what it turned into was heartbreaking. Eden in the newsroom with reaction from Jesse Brown's family following his death. Eden. So heartbreaking, Louie and Nicole. The boy's cousin says the outpouring of support from the community shows just how many lives he touched. People came out to a memorial ceremony to honor his life all his trophies. trophies and his baby pictures, his gloves. Megan Brown says her little cousin Jesse was such a special boy. Jesse was the coolest kid, hilarious and a really tough kid. At Jesse's parents house, his family has this table area set up filled with pictures of the boy along with things that tell the story of his life. Helmets and we brought it to the service for everybody to sign their name on. Brown says Jesse had an accident on the treadmill and sprained his ankle. And what they thought was a minor injury days later proved to be something very different. His leg was covered in like a reddish purpley splotchiness and that was the first sign of the strep A. Brown says Jesse ended up with a flesh eating bacteria. It festered in his ankle because that is the weak spot from where he sprained his ankle. Um, and then it just continued throughout his body. Once it got into his bloodstream, his organs started shutting down. She says the sudden loss of her cousin has impacted their family in a way none of them could have ever imagined. A memorial sits in front of his house, things there placed by his friends and his neighbors. Meantime, a pediatrician now reacting about the severity of the bacteria that ended Jesse's life. There is no relationship between getting strep throat, group A strep in the throat, and the invasive type of bacteria that goes into this body and cause, cause and can cause um, infections of the bone or the joints, or in this case, the flesh eating bacteria. Orange County Public Schools has started a memorial fund in Jesse's honor. The school district says Jesse was such a sweet kid. He was in the safety patrol program and one of his favorite things to do was raise the flag on the flagpole. So the school folded up one of the flags he raised and gave it to his family in his honor. Louie. So heartbreaking, right? Thank you, Eden, for that.